All right, hey guys, here I am again. So I just bought this and I undid an unboxing and I screwed the video up. So I'm gonna do a quick show and tell here. This is a ring light that came with this boom arm. This boom arm is by Luling Arts. I paid $18 for this as well because I had points. Um, came with a ring light, came with a gooseneck for the wing, ring light, came with a shock mount, pop filter, Right here, pop filter, there it is, pop filter. And another mic clip. And I set this up and I don't like it. Uh, it's kind of flimsy. Uh, I think the toner one was better. Uh, it's more, it's solid. I wish it didn't break. Um, well, it was broken when I opened it, um, right here at the bottom. And, uh, but I, I really like this. I like this one and I think I'm going to just send them both back and get the uh, longer one because yeah I need that long I like this because it had 16 inches instead of 13 and it is definitely in the middle of my I can have it down here and I can see my screen I can have my mic right like this I like that um, so I think I'm gonna get the longer one and the other thing I the clamp the toner clamp is bigger it's much nicer um, and it also opens up wider so I'm able to put it on the side of my desk because I have a really thick piece of metal over here that my desk is made out of metal by a company called Wavebone which is awesome um, but yeah this didn't open up as much the C-clamp um, and this is much more solid than this one this is kind of flimsy uh, I do like having this little I don't know if you can see it down here this little nut down here uh, that you're able to secure this a little bit better, but like these springs are already extended all the way. Uh, I'm gonna send it back. I'm gonna go bring it back tomorrow. Um, and unfortunately, you know, uh, it didn't work out the way I thought it would. Um, find five fine microphone for fifty dollars online. Um, I will tell you, it sounds amazing. It's a plastic microphone. I mean, it's not great. As far as the construction goes, I mean, it's solid. I mean, if you know, you, I'm not gonna, it's, I'm in a studio. I'm not gonna bang it around and throw it around and stuff. I don't do that with any of my mics actually, but I have more expensive microphones um, that sound great, but this one sounds really good for a USB mic. Um, and it also has a mute touch button on the top, touch button in the back. I reviewed this uh, on my other uh, video that I did. Um, to change the colors, it's got a touch button and it's got a headphone jack, you know. Fi Fine. This is uh, Luling Arts and that's a toner arm, the one that uh, I opened up and it was broken. Uh, if you go back and watch my other video, you can see what happened. Um, but yeah, this is too flimsy for me and it's going back. I mean, the ring light thing was cool. This is pretty cool. Um, I didn't turn it on or anything. I didn't set it up because I just wanted to make sure if I liked the arm or not. If I liked it, I would have kept it, but I'm not keeping it. So uh, I'm going to order the larger toner one and send these two back tomorrow. So, yeah, we'll see what happens when I get the larger one and we'll do another video. All right. Stay creative, guys. Thanks. Hi, guys. So I'm back. Um, I kept the toner on, believe it or not. I was going to send it back, but I decided to keep the toner on. Um, T-O-N-O-R, toner. Um, I fixed it. I bought a screw. Um, I like it. The other one that I had by Lee Leeling Arts, I sent it back today. I didn't like it. Um, it was nice, but it wasn't sturdy. This has a nice sturdy base to it. Um, I got some extenders uh, by a company uh, by the name of Bosen, B-O-S-E-E-N. Um, and it's an extension and I, they give you two for, I believe it was like 10 bucks, like $9. Um, it comes wrapped in this, uh, paper so it doesn't get scratched. Two of these adapters are really cool. Um, I don't know if you can see that. Uh, but yeah, so I'm going to just grab the, the camera right now and I'm going to show you, um, what I did. And let me just grab it right here. See, so what I did was I bought this screw. Um, it cost me like five bucks for four screws and four nuts. And I actually put it in right here. 
and it's nice and solid and yeah and so now I have the um, Fi Fine microphone which sounds amazing again I can't get over how good this microphone sounds doing some scratch tracks with it um, and I was actually looking at some other stuff and I'll show you on Amazon here uh, beat run um, and a microphone boom I'm sorry and I was gonna buy that and I decided not to because it's sixty four dollars and it also has this cool little uh, headphone which faces the opposite way which the toner one does not the toner one faces in so if you have it it's good to hide it I guess under the desk I don't know I like this one because it faces out but I'm not spending sixty four dollars on this one um, only because uh, I just like the toner arm, uh, and I only paid $18 for it because I had some Amazon points. This is a $50 microphone by Fifine, and I paid $39 for that because I used my points. Again, it's crazy um, that this mic sounds good and the toner arm's fine. I, like I said, I kept it. It does come with a, again, windscreen, which I could use for another microphone. Uh, it also comes with this really nice, which was better than the Leeling Arts. Um, this is a much nicer uh, pop filter, uh, which I probably will use on something else because the pop filter that comes with the Five Fine is made out of metal and it actually works pretty good. There's no, uh, the plosions are actually not bad. I don't know. I got out of it cheap. I really still have my eye on that, that beat run, uh, boom arm um because i do like it um oh and the uh toner arm also came with an extra mic clip so yeah so i'll put descriptions uh in the video um for the toner arm and the bosine uh extenders um and the fine five fine i keep messing that up um but yeah so there you have it i just thought i'd make another video and tell you where I'm going with this. But again, I've been using this for scratch tracks and it actually sounds really good. I don't know if you can hear this. Um, I'll play this. I should have it connected to my interface, but I don't. So you're gonna hear it over the speaker. So pardon the audio. Oh, my time is for so yeah, so you know, I don't know how good that sounded over the camera microphone, but that was a scratch track that I did, and I actually might keep it because it actually came out that good. So um, anyway, stay creative. That's all I got to say. Peace.